<clears throat> hey guys, Desletter Magic here. Probably should have set up my mic ahead of time, shouldn't I? So who's gonna claim the prize of being the first person in the live chat? It's Guy Lad Peleon, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm just gonna call you GP. <laughs> Howdy, everybody. It says there's zero people watching, but there's people typing. You must all just exist in my head and be figments of my imagination. That makes sense. Well, I figured I was going to just record a video against a person. I'm like, why would I not just stream it? Like, that makes way more sense. Plus, I'll probably actually leave this one up if it's not the typical X-Mage disaster, which is usually what it is. I mean, it's either just getting trolled or people trying to type stupid shit in the chat or just whatever. Oh, my goal is to just come after anybody who's playing red. So I'm really hoping that some people is. So, some people are. I need to get more sleep. A player has joined the table. All right, there we go. I'm pretty Your sure that's a stream. Started. Of course, right this second, somebody calls my damn cell phone. Well, they can piss off. <laughs> oh, it's my brother. <laughs> oh, it's actually a text. Okay. Let's see, what is this? Wall, aerial, loan. That's eh, not bad. I can keep that. That's not bad. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Oh, my brother's complaining that he was the first to comment on my live chat. Or no, he's complaining that he tried to be the first person to comment on my live chat, live stream. God, I can't even frickin' talk today. Hold on. I should probably be playing Magic right now. Um, <laughs> and he's mad that I blocked him, but he put my actual real name in the chat, so that's a damn good reason to block him. All right, here we go. I set it on a 20 minute timer and I don't want to like lose. <laughs> oh good, Spire Bluff Canal. Well, that means he's probably playing control and this is going to be a really crap game. You know how you can just tell? Like it, they drop one land and you're like, well, it's that deck. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's something else. Oh, my allergies are really bugging me today. It's been raining out on and off. Aether Hub. So this is maybe energy control? I don't think it's Rush. He would have had something out. Should be interesting. Anything control heavy has a chance of beating anything. Like, it doesn't even matter what your deck is. It just might beat anything. So I'm going to drop in Glory so that I can Sandstone him next time, and then it'll be 15 to 25. And... I wouldn't say you can't come back from that, but it really does lower the odds. Oh, there we go. Oh, he uh, flashed it. Very clever. Um, this might be... Oh, no, now he added green. I was going to say it's classic red, white, blue, like draw stall. I don't know what the hell he's running. I don't remember anybody. My favorite commander deck is my only assembled commander deck, which is my Isperia Don't Attack Me deck. All right, here we go. This will be fun. Because now I'm going to override his defense. <laughs> now here's the other thing. Here's the other thing. This deck has so much synergy. I'm going to drop out a Lone Rider. Hopefully he doesn't counter it. Honestly, whether it's first main phase or second, doesn't matter. So now we're going to bring Glory Bound, and almost regardless, unless he has something really wacky like an immolating off of an Aether Hub, boom, there's five, and then I'm going to flip my Lone Rider. And I've basically already won at that point. Oh, it probably is Teamer Energy. <laughs> I should have thought of that. <laughs> Solstead knows what's up. I don't remember anybody from the last stream, except for that Canadian kid, and I don't know why I remember him. Why would he possibly... Unless he's cycling it. I think he is. Oh, no, there we go. That's not very nice. Uh, I actually already did ban you for... Um, oh, wait. I can't talk to him. He's not watching the live stream. 
He just kept putting forest over and 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 over in every single video. So I just said, screw it and banned him. Unless it's an inside joke I'm familiar with, I just assume it's some stupid troll comment. So whatever. This is redefining slow. Oh, Rogue Refiner. Wow, I just get some energy. I just hate energy decks. I hate everything about energy. I like it as a mechanic, but I don't like the decks that resulted. They're just too good. The whole problem with energy would be perfectly appropriate if it was limited to two color, but the fact that people can play three color, it's just too good, too adaptable. The sideboard options are too good. And that, I could say that, that about any three color deck. It's just too damn good. Oh, I'd have to sideboard in something to deal with Ulamog if that's what he's going for. Um, let's see. A 3-3 would not get past it. I'm just going to have to double drop on him. Oh, he's got F9 on. I can tell. So that means he's not playing anything, which means there we go. So I'm going to kill his shielded, which means he's going to let it through, which means it's 10 to 31. Oh, boy. I am going to make a, a video about slivers when hell freezes over. Oh, he blocked it. Interesting. I still have 31, though. You can see why this deck just... It, like, even if I'm not playing Red Rush, it still runs away with the game. I mean, it's just... You'd almost have to try to, uh... Um... What do you call it? To, um... Like, not have a combination that does anything. Uh, I only ban people if they are clearly a terrible person. Oh, what the hell does this do? Something with lands and zombies or something. Let's see. Okay, two. Put them onto the battlefield. Nice. Shove your library. Okay. Yes, refuse to play the person playing slivers. That's my strategy against slivers. It's like that quote from Stargate SG-1. Something about blah, 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 deny them battle. Something. I don't know. It was deep. Oh, blessed. That's a shame. All right, so let's see where this goes. Actually, I'm going to up the attack power because he's at 14. I know I should save some for blessed, but it doesn't take out Ulamog, does it? Let me see. What is the wording? Oh, no, sack. It would. That's fun. All right, so I'm going to click on this land. It gains haste regardless because that's good. I don't remember if it came out. So now I can swing with it. And everything I have but the wall, obviously, is going to absolutely destroy him. So, uh, I'm going to get hit on the counter swing, but that's the thing. I don't care. That's why if Always Watching doesn't come out, I really still don't care. Because <laughs> it's just so much life gain. I don't play three-color decks. I don't build them or play them. So, no, I probably wouldn't be able to help with it. <laughs> People who play Slivers should be ashamed of themselves. And honestly, I don't know why everybody trips out over Slivers and they're perfectly okay with, like, Merfolk and Elves. I hate pretty much all tribals. I can't stand goblins. I can't stand... Well, maybe wizards. That would be kind of cool. I can't stand humans right now in standard. Um, it's just all terrible. That's true. If you tap them, they can't do a damn thing. So I was running around like playing Pokemon Go all day, and I caught 12 Moltresses. <laughs> Oh no, what am I to do? Dude, if it was wizards and dinosaurs, I will build that. Oh shoot, this is gonna hurt. Unless he doesn't cast it. I'm confused. What the hell is going on right now? <laughs> There it is. That is what my deck lives in fear of. But remember, he's a 4-4 and the wall's still there. And look at the life total. So it's like, it's not like I'm not going to come back from it. And that authority of the consoles is just wrecking him. I mean, it's not like he has haste, but the one life has been more than one life. Um, and obviously one of the cards I have in hand here is going to kill him. What does that do? 
Oh. That's interesting. That's like a really garbage version of that Pilgrim's Eye. Oh, I almost feel bad, but I don't. All right, here we go. Arr. That was fun. <laughs> so I'm at what, 42? <laughs> this deck is just like downright discouraging. Like it, I would hate to play against this. I'm almost definitely going to build this in real life, but I'm going to the next F and M as, or as I'm going to be cosplaying uh, myself. Um, I'm going to bring Stalin steamroll tool cause it's already built. So whatever. I think it, it's kind of like this deck. It's not terribly dissimilar. Uh, here we go. Okay. I could use that. That'll be fun. So now this has trample. So he's going to lose basically everything, which is why I wish I had like an animate land trick or something. Should I tell him it has trample? Oh, he figured it out. Uh, let's target him first. There we go. He's going to, um, yeah, there we go. There it is. Why would that go on that row though? Since when did the lands go on two rows? I've never seen that. Hmm, okay. Well, there's one rollover, so he is going to need a miracle to win. And this deck just doesn't know how to take off the gas pedal, so... Yeehaw! <laughs> now he would have to draw multiple cards to stop this. I mean, this deck just doesn't lose. It, it's, it would maybe even be, uh, beat a mill deck because it wins on turn six unopposed. But I am worried about, you know, big honking sweeps that just leave me with zero cards in hand. That's never good. But, uh, like, Gisela can't survive that. With always watching, she could. Like, the Sweltering Suns. Almost nothing in my deck survives Sweltering Suns. Even the animated land off wall. I don't think Terminus is legal. <laughs> oh, boy, he drew four cards. Oh, boy. He's going to need a removal spell and... Yeah, there's he can't win because of trample and because of authority of the consoles. So forty-eight to two, ouch. Oh, I really want to join somebody else's game. Standard one thousand plus. I don't know. That's probably my ranking. Let's uh, let's piss him off. There we go. <laughs> I'm probably rated like fourteen hundred. I don't even care. My my score keeps going up and down, and I Your never play ranked started. matches. All right, so he's going to get wrecked by my sideboard. Uh, ooh, two Blesseds and two lands. I don't like the rest of it, but that's actually pretty funny. Oh, he's going first. Oh, that sucks. That's going to make Blessed a lot harder. Okay, blue-black, probably blue-black zombies. He's some arrogant stuck-up net decker, obviously. So this is going to be twice as funny when I beat him. I mean, it's, it's obviously scared of blue-black black zombies, and he's like, oh, you're only allowed to play with me if you're over a thousand. Otherwise, you're not good enough for me. Well, fuck you, too. All right, let's see. Oh, shit. Don't have a target. Fucking hell. All right, what is this? Maybe he's playing something different. I don't know. You could throw that into anything. I never actually looked at a Scarab God deck. All uh, right, okay, that just sucks. I'm just going to throw it in and just not drop it till next turn because I don't need it. Oh, fuck you. I didn't need it anyway. Asshole. I almost should have just thrown in the sandstone then, but I want to use it on maybe Lone Rider or something. I don't know. I got always watching. It almost doesn't matter. What the fuck is this? Is this like improvise or something? Or like energy? I don't even know what he's playing. Uh, here we go. Well, it's obviously control spam, but good luck now. Uh, I can't really drop it yet, but I also don't need it. So it's just like, whatever, just get it on the damn field. Because if I want to get it plus one in Vigilance, I'll just do Always Watching next turn. But uh, this was a really weak opening hand. And I don't really know what he's doing. He's, oh, fuck you. He's probably um, doing something very creatureless. So that starting with the two Blesseds is just dumb. But remember, this is two out of three. So... This is going to be funny, but if this is a free cast, you know, Ulamog energy improvised thing. Oh, I hate that deck so much. Um, I don't know if I should bring out the big guns, the big blockers or what? I don't know. I mean, I just have no idea what I'm playing against. 
Saw that coming. He's going for a counter spell. He's going for um, Essence Scatter. And he doesn't have the mana for it, so what's the point? Oh, no, he does have the mana. God, this is going to be fucking annoying. What does his ult do? Oh, that's annoying as shit, but he's going to lose him. That, that ultimate is nothing. It can't even touch me. All right. Let's have some fun. Oh, good. I'm glad he got that. I just, this deck doesn't have the control to play against control, and it doesn't have the control to, um, yeah, fuck you two and your miracle pull, whatever. Um, it does have the speed, but if he's running control and a late game combo deck, I can't beat it. Oh, good, he pulled another one. Well, at least one of us is pulling good cards. Fucking dick. I should just forfeit and go to the second turn, but I want to see what he's doing. Because I, I shouldn't have kept this. I needed more lands. I shouldn't have kept this. What the fuck? You get an emblem with it at the beginning of combat. Oh, target artifact you control becomes a 5-5. Five five. Okay. All right. Um, That wouldn't work, but I'm going to do it anyway. So he's just going to think, oh, he's out of cards. He's out of cards. Hell no. Somebody's about to get blessed. <laughs> Oh, he's just trying to pound me to death with artifacts? Then he's going to lose. The fuck is he doing? How does he get to his ult so fucking quick? God damn, that's fucking annoying. Yeah, fuck you. Go for it. Wait a minute. Does that not say until end of turn? It's permanent. He permanently gets it to be... Oh my fucking God, that's annoying. Okay, one of the very, 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 very few decks that can actually beat me, and you know he's going to counterspell this. So fucking sick of these control decks. All right, fuck it, let's go to game two. All right, so now I know what he's going to do. Um, let's see, I don't need that, I don't need that, that's not good enough, and immolating I'm definitely throwing in. Uh, authority is pointless, doesn't do anything. Um, let's see... Those aren't good enough to stop one, and he doesn't rush, so I'll take one of those out. Uh, repel, make a stand, not good enough. Deck, I could use, but it's a sorcery. I mean, it, hmm, that's a hard one. Blessed, I'd absolutely need. I think between Blessed and Immolating, I should be good. I just need an opening hand that isn't complete and utter bullshit. Your game has started. But yeah, there's a reason that Tezzeret is really fucking expensive. Um, two hours watching in a Gisela? What the fuck am I going to do with that? But I ain't going to six. I needed just speed. Just absolute speed rush. Like a, a turn a turn three swing for five lifelink would have been nice. All right, let's see what we get. I mean, gear shift will be cool, but I absolutely don't need him against this deck at all. Like, my whole deck is completely irrelevant. I'm just sick of playing against that much control. I mean, you know he's running 20 control spells. It's so fucking transparent. But with me going first, he loses the entire advantage. I mean, Essence Scatter, Sensor, all that shit, it's too expensive. So if I, the other thing is Sensor is a dead card if I can get out enough um, uh, lands. Come on. Today, asshole. There we go. Oh, God, Prophetic Prism. Very damn good card. That'll help him out a ton. God, my black improvised deck would just shred the shit out of him because of all of the um, card discard. So I could just drop on an always watching, but yeah, that's all I can do. I mean, these are just shit draws. It's absolute shit. I'm never going to get Gisela out. But um, hitting him for three doesn't really do anything. I need to absolutely knock him over with a combo. So, I mean, a combination of a deck I don't have a natural advantage against and then really, really, really garbage draws, that's a bad combo. I could still bring this back. Oh, fuck you. That's a complete waste. Complete and utter waste. He's going to gain like one life or two life or something. That's just stupid. I would have held on to it. Uh, unless he's watching my stream and knows I don't have another creature. Getting real sick of people doing that. There we go. This deck just keeps on hitting. There we go. Uh, He is land screwed though. So keep that in mind. Okay, fuck you. Maybe he's not. 
Uh, so that's counterspell territory. Obviously, he has one. Clear as day. So let's see if he's dumb enough to use it on this. And honestly, if he doesn't, I'm going to swing for three. So <laughs> then he's going to flip. Ooh, center. Uh, fuck you. He doesn't even know I have another one. Uh, let's see. Well, he can't win every game. I mean, luck's going to catch up with you eventually. I love the phrasing on that. Would you like to? I would like to, but I don't have the mana. <laughs> Sensor is just an unreliable card. Like, for real, if he goes up against a ramp deck, it's a dead card. I mean, against me, he probably uh, keep it in, don't sideboard it out. But Disallow or just Negate or Essence Scatter is so much better. I mean, like, so, so, so much better. Uh, but, yeah, these bad matchups happen. I mean, it's whatever. But, yeah, this deck, it, it, it runs, like, 28 creatures, I think, or something like that. <sighs> what? The fuck does he want? Every time. Wait, I hit... Oh. It was... Okay. <laughs> it was supposed to be showing the OK button, and I hit F9, but since it thought I hit F9, it didn't draw it. That's just fucking weird. Um, I could just be a complete asshole and play Blessed Gain 4 and just flip him, but, uh, let's see if he's dumb enough to waste another counter spell on this. Nope. So either he got wise or he doesn't have one, but that was fast enough to be an F9, which means he doesn't have a control spell. Because if you have any kind of control spell at all, you do not press F9. That's why playing on X-Mage is a little rough because people can tell stuff like that. There we go. And then he's going to flip. There's almost no coming back from this, but I know he has control. And he took a while to sideboard, too, so he could have any kind of crazy shit in there. I don't remember what Supreme Will does. Probably something bad. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, wonderful. Well, I got two more creatures. I don't give a shit. Uh, and his... Oh, his lands don't untap. Well, that's almost just like a wash. I mean, I kind of miss him because I like that creature, but this is going to be really funny. All right, watch this. Boom! Right there, I knew it. So, he already has Vig. I don't need it. I need it on the next one. Let's just drop him. There we go. And I can target him. There we go. And here we go. So, he's going to be swinging for four in the air next turn. And then I've got a Gazelle on backup, which I'll do second main phase. Oh, he dropped a land. He is getting just kicked in the nuts by Lady Luck. Um, Let's see. I'm playing on X-Mage, the worst platform for playing Magic ever. Uh, let's see, I don't need any flip, I don't need any triggers, I really don't need his shit to come in untapped either. I just don't know, I mean, I don't need more life, so... Eh, fuck it. He can't counter it, so now he's gotta come up with two kill spells, which... And then Fatal Push does not work on either one of these, uh, unless he can make something leave, which he can't. I mean, he's playing Sensor and Fatal Push. Those are the two least reliable control spells, and he's not playing a speed deck. That's just stupid. He should be running Murder and Disallow because, oh, no, one more mana. He fucking has it. I mean, decks like this run tons of mana. Oh, shit. There's a sweep. Wait, that's not going to do anything. I wonder if he knows that's not going to do anything. <sighs> Great. Someone's watching my stream and reporting what fucking cards I'm playing to him. Fuck you. Oh, and they're a South Park fan. Why am I surprised? There we go. Hopefully that boots him out of the lobby completely. I think it does. So he burned two cards to get rid of one creature. Ouch. Yeah, as if he can stop it. Um, I need the Blessed just in case and the Immolating just in case, so I'm just going to throw out the weaker creature. And there we go. I could be playing this deck with my hand revealed in real life and it wouldn't really help anybody. <laughs> I'd just be like, oh look, I've got two swing removals. Have fun, there we go. So, see, I always appreciate when people hit concede when they know the game is over. You know, because it just saves time. It's not like you're being a sore loser. It's like, no, just save time, you know? Um, that worked, so... Your game has started. <laughs> I almost could put in Make a Stand and pull something else, but I don't want to, like, go overkill here, because <laughs> I'm probably going to win this one, although with him going first, it's a huge advantage. That is some shit right there. Uh, I mean, I do have the Glory Mound combo, but all he has to do is counter it and I'm dead, so... 
I mean, immolating though, he wouldn't be able to hit me. I guess I'll keep it and I'll hope that within four turns it re it uh, recovers or improves. Because I get to start with an eighth card. So this is going to be really pushing it. Like, I probably just lost because of that. But I still think it was the right decision and I stand by it. All right. Uh, Ariel. Okay. That's not bad. Boop. Yeah, Glory Bound is quite good. I think I ranked it one of the best cards in all of them on Cat. It's pretty damn good. Um, there we go. And if he counters this, I wouldn't really care because Ariel's a better card. Oh, yeah, he also is running double black. <laughs> but if he, like, grasps it or something, whatever. I mean, I don't really give a shit. Oh, and he can't use that. Wow. Oh, there it is. Okay, Never Return is a damn good card. People don't play it enough. It's in my other deck, and it's really annoying. I'm not going to buy Dark Souls. I'm broke. Got to buy food. All right, let's see. Um, I mean, this followed by Always Watching would be smarter. Fucking asshole. Whatever. He doesn't have the cards to stop me, so I don't really give a shit. All right, there we go. I'm stremaying. <laughs> I am the typing. I wish I could block people from the stream. I really fucking do. I'm going to screenshot it so I can send it out on Twitter. Maybe somebody will find them. That's the way I do business. Um, Yeah, I'll have to drop a Shafet. And then one, two, three. And there we go. So now I can block for days. And I don't really need the always watching yet. All right, let's have some fun. So the always watchings will be nice, but if he counters both, it doesn't really affect this deck. Um, it does make them more susceptible to sweltering, though. But so does not drinking enough Gatorade. Ew. <laughs> okay, here we go. So now here's, here's the fun part about this, if you didn't realize this. I have two mana open, and this cannot tap. So. <laughs> Interesting. I wonder if I can turn off spectators completely if they actually added that feature. That'd be really nice. I don't know if they did. Wait, is this orb blocking? No, it's only attacking. Okay. 23 to 8. It doesn't look so good for him. I mean, usually slow decks will lose, but he has way too much control for me to even keep a creature on the field. He's just not pulling it. Oh, ain't that a bitch. All right. I should nickname this deck, I've got another one. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is so bad. I almost feel bad playing this, but I don't, because it's fucking awesome. Oh, if he pulls a negate or an essence scatter, well, it would have to be essence. Let me guess. You didn't. Nope. All right. Free swing. And if things get dire, I could pop both of those Blighteds. I mean, that would be no problem at all. What is he... Oh, he's cycling it. Probably because I got a fuck ton of lands. <laughs> well, that's the thing. It's a dead card, but it has cycle. That card would be unplayable without cycle. So he's down to four, and he just popped a land. I think I got this. Here comes the forfeit. Oh, shit. <laughs> you know what's a real shame, though? I've got another one. Oh, Shafat, fun. All right. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Just gonna keep on coming. He does have four cards in hand, though. I mean, if it was like a Planeswalker, he might be able to pull this off. Ooh, that'll hit him hard, but I'm gonna leave that. Well, actually, I, this would be lethal. I almost should have went the conservative route, but there it is. If you see the win, go for the win, because if I lost it to a counter spell, I wouldn't care, and Thalia would come out next turn. Boom! There it is. Two out of three. That's why the last stream I kept telling people, if I could sideboard, I would have crushed the person. Nobody ever believes me, but guess what? All right, let's see. Let's join his. Ooh, Canadian person. I like Your Canadian people. They're way more polite. That is not a stereotype. 
Uh, oh, now there is some shit right there. Okay, that is some cards. Like, that ain't even playing around. I actually can just, like, cover the cards, but where's the fun in that? Like, if I was playing a combo deck or some real big mystery deck, I would cover the cards on X-Mage, or on the stream, but I just don't give a shit. <laughs> oh, God, I got two authorities. Didn't even realize that. This is going to be funny. This is one of those scenarios where I wish I knew what he was playing. <laughs> you know, because then, like, if it was some kind of creature rush, I would bring out the second authority, but hopefully the land that he plays tells me. Didn't tell me shit. All right. <laughs> um, I'll go for the loan. Why not? I mean, Glory's cool, but without the Sandstone or the Always, he's not that good because then I could only hit him for one turn out of the next two. Solstead's a Canadian. What? No way. I had no idea Canada was so anti-gun. I thought, like, moose attacks and... French people attacks, you would just walk around with a gun 24-7, but uh, I guess not. Oh, there's always watching, so I will bring out Authority and then Glory, and the next turn he'll be off Summoning Sickness, and I'll have always watching, and that's five. I tell you, when this when this deck doesn't go first, it's not a big deal, and when it does go first, it's a big deal. <laughs> well, it's more like moose, moose is attacking cars by the cars hitting the moose. <laughs> But I heard that the mooses will eat up a bunch of, um, uh, what do you call it, a bunch of uh, cranberries that have been sitting on the ground and fermenting, and then they get, like, drunk as hell and start attacking cars. That happened at least once, because I saw it on True TV. There it is. Boom! And he is in deep trouble, even if he has another um, kill spell. I'm, like, I'm honestly surprised at how good this deck is, like, in general. Like, usually when I build an assassin deck that only beats one type of deck, it's just garbage against anything else, but this is actually working. Oh, he's running, uh, is, this is Black White Deserts. That's actually a pretty good deck, from what I heard. Couldn't tell you what's in it, but I heard it's good. <laughs> oh, no. Why is he running that? Is this black white desert ingest? Wait, what just happened? Did I actually have a card in exile? I wasn't paying any attention. I don't know, whatever. I don't give a shit. All right, here we go. <laughs> Let's bring out something worse. There, block a flyer, dick. I'm not gonna build a Shadowborn Apostle deck. I have some standards. Although that eight cost demon is pretty fucking good with that. Like that was the first thing I thought of. He's running white black colorless devoid eldrazi ingest all right <laughs> i gotta say i've never seen that it's cool though i mean somebody tried to beat me with black white vampire allies the other day and they came damn close uh okay i could use that that's not bad that's not bad um one two one two three this is just better all right here we go Hopefully I didn't just get one of my lands killed because I kind of need it. But honestly, unless I have a Gazelle, I don't really care about anything above three mana. Yeah, block them. You know you want to. You know you want to. Right, there we go. I hope this isn't a Graveyard Resurrection deck too because bringing back Reality Smasher from the Graveyard with one of the five cost sorceries that are black, that would be pretty damn good. But he's got to have something to do with deserts and I don't remember what... Um, uh, what do you call it? What the, um, what the good desert cards are in black and white. I remember black has a really good one, though. Oh, cast out. There you go. That's a start. I hope he hits the flyer. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Do, 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 do hit the flyer. Okay. That's an option. <laughs> he must have, like, Immolating Glare or something for the aerial. Not gonna stop swinging with it, though. Oh, ain't that a bitch. Um, so... <laughs> oh, that wouldn't quite be enough on the planes. Damn. Okay, there we go. Um, it's probably not even worth dropping, but I don't know. I guess hitting him for one more there would be kind of funny, so... Let's do it. 
He's so far away from lethal, though. Like, I don't feel safe with this 36. He's, he's planning something. Them Canadians are always planning something. <laughs> this didn't get hit with three fatal pushes. Oh, she does all kinds of weird shit. He, no matter what, he's going to get something valuable. Like, he's going to have a choice. And I do believe Blessed Alliance is still in there, and he could fund it. <laughs> he comes in tap. That's funny. Okay, this many spectators are definitely going to crash the game. I should have signed in with one of my throwaway names. Oh, yeah, the Black Deserts are negative one counters. That's right. I remember it was something really good. Okay, so I'm going to need, like, an always watching or... Uh, I don't know about that. I mean, he won't quite flip either. That's the problem. And there's no sense in lighting that up, but there's also no sense in letting him know I have this. Uh, I could just let him kill one and just go for the overswing. That's probably smarter, because that would be bare minimum four damage. Um... But it wouldn't be the next turn, though. Yeah, I could afford to lose one. Because, I mean, I could just flood swing next turn with loan. But, I don't know. Plus, he, he might let him through if he's, like, a complete idiot. <laughs> he might think I have, like, a boost spell or something. But if it was, like, Mighty Leap, I would have played it already. I don't know. The mind games are the best part of magic. can tell he's struggling doesn't know what's going on and he's canadian so i know he's not just stalling the game out oh there we go all right that makes sense that's what i would do that four damage though that's gonna hurt him Oh, uh, no, it doesn't currently even run Fragmentize in the sideboard. Um, if your local meta has, like, really dangerous enchantments, I would do it, though. Like, Stasis Field and Cast Out. I mean, even that. Like, you can afford to lose a creature with this one. It's not a big deal. And if you lost it with counters on it, do you really want it back? You know, but, um, yeah, it's not a bad idea. Especially since Fragmentize can hit vehicles, too. All right, there we go. Yeah, first strike, main strike. Come on, Grandma, let's go. I was really hoping he would, like, flash in a creature, because that, with authority, would be enough to flip Lone Rider retroactively, even though he's not on the field yet. That's just how it works. There, I bet he's real happy to see that. There we go. <laughs> so I've got 40 life and a 0-6 wall on the field. How does a person even psychologically handle that? <laughs> Oh my god, there's a wild Bulbasaur out in front of my apartment. Holy crap. Okay, let's get out the Ultra Balls and the Pineapple Berries. I just spent like 20 rare candy on my Ivysaur, so. Oh, there we go. Curveball excellent. That should do it. I don't even care about the magic game anymore. <laughs> what, what do we even play? What is this, Hearthstone? Oh, that's a shame. That is a shame. That is a crying shame. I feel bad. Everybody on my side gets plus one. That's probably lethal. Yep. <laughs> oh, spell lands. I love them. Even blighteds. Hey, I caught the Bulbasaur. All right. Um, oh, what did he even have? He didn't even get anything off against me. <laughs> I mean, I could, for the reality smasher, I could run deck, but I mean, why? Uh, authority did really well. I wouldn't pull that. Gearshift did moderately well, but I don't know. I mean, wall was pretty good. I did need that. That was good. I can't really drop anything. I mean, oh, he's not running Rush. So I could get rid of the Tasseled, Tasseled, God Pharaoh, God Pharaoh, and then put in four, or, well, removal, 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 swing, removal. There we go. That'll piss him off. <laughs> I just just tanked my creature abilities, but I still have like 20 plus in the deck, and I just don't need the fast zero fours. They aren't going to help me against him. Your game. The question is, do I have enough to get a Venusaur? 
Because that, that would be the true dinosaur tribal. Because he's a Bulbasaur, like Bulbasaurus. Uh, this is a pretty hardcore opening hand. I mean, that looks mean. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to keep this. Here we go. Let's see what the eighth card is, because at this point, I don't fucking need it. <laughs> this is going to be really messed right. up. Oh, a deck. <laughs> oh, shit. So the question is, since I really don't need the sandstone, and I really need the third, do I drop it first? So I'm going to say yes. I mean, I lose the boost, I lose the ambush, but unless I pull a glory bound next turn, I'm not going to regret this. <laughs> um, nom nom, Nivor. I have seen all the memes. Wildfire Eternal deck? I don't remember what that does. I remember it being a really damn good card, though. Oh, there's glory bound. <laughs> Shit. Okay, whatever. I don't need I don't need to go 25-15. Screw it. <laughs> and Barry Wright from the Psychic Friends Hotline. You should sue GTA Vice City. Thumbs up if you got that reference. Hey, there's 95 of you watching instead of the usual 180. I guess people had something better to do. <laughs> Okay, what the fuck does this do? Okay, so you may put a card from Exile. I don't have one. I don't think I even had one last time. He must have exiled something and I just didn't notice. Um, Blighted is better than Shafet. That's more of a, you know, surprise. Um, I don't have a way to boost him. Yeah. I miss him already. All right, there we go. Giving him a clue probably wasn't the best idea. I should have waited and just stalled it out. But uh, I don't know what his deck does late game, so... Yeah. <laughs> Illusionary Mask, I love that card. I think I made a video about it. Oh, yeah, Chains of Mephistopheles. Try making sense of that. Oh, shit. Well, no, here's the thing, though. He can only choose an on-land card. Okay. So I'm good on the Shafet, and he's looking at this like, what the fuck am I going to do about three of those creatures? Because <laughs> he's going to grab one. Which one did he grab? Oh, Aerial Responder. Very smart. He can't stop flyers. Okay. Why it was still rendering in my hand, I don't know. I should have just drop Shafet. I mean, fuck it. He already saw it, but... Uh, um, I mean... Nothing I have would really particularly stop Thoughtseize. Oh, except Glory. Glory next turn would do it. So then I'll, I'll just drop these two board presents. Now, if he runs a Bantu, I'm going to be in trouble, though. There we go. So Shafet would be kind of nice because I'd lose one, but the other one would flip. So I'm probably going to have to do that. Oh, unless he sweeps the board. I knew it. I knew he would sweep the board. I just knew it because I put too much out. I might actually lose this one. At least he's only hit me for two. All right, there we go. Oh, that's not bad, actually. Okay, so one, two, three, and I can't quite drop it yet, but this might hurt him a little bit. Doesn't stop shambling, though, and I have a feeling he's going to turn the life totals around, but nope, not quite. Do I have something in exile? Oh, I fucking do. Shit. <laughs> that sucks. By the way, the X is the exile zone, not, um, what do you call it, uh... Well, I fucking lost. Not 10th edition. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm in trouble. I'm in a lot of trouble. I have no way of coming back from this. Even Blighted can't do shit. Oh, and then he's popping a clue. <laughs> shit. Hey, Serene, that'll help. That'll just solve everything. Um, honestly, if I get if I get an aerial responder out, then I can win. I mean, she's a 3-3. Three, three. That's not nothing, but I can't trade because she's like a trigger. Um, I gotta go turn on my AC. It's hot as shit in here. Oh my god, there's a fucking chin chow outside my apartment now. <laughs> what? Oh fuck, I just lost. <laughs> shit. 7, 12, fuck it. Bring it all, I don't care. I was at level 848 Chin Chow. Like, that ain't no joke. Well, what is the point of that? <laughs> Whatever. He just wants to scry one, doesn't he? Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. That is what I was waiting for. I don't think I'm saved. I think I still lost, but it's funny that it happened. 
Um, all right, Volley's watching. Let's hit him. The problem is on the block, he doesn't have first strike, so I can't put the counter on and then double block with uh, Serene. Because that's a fun trick. I don't even remember. We're on game two or something, I think, so I think I'm going to beat him the third game. Like, with me going fast, it's just... Oh, I caught the Chincho. Kick ass. Oh, I could evolve it, too. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Is there really a Machop in the area? Hold the fuck on. There is. Fucking hell. Well, this is the last game I'm streaming. <laughs> I need those more than you guys could ever imagine. Uh, is that another reality? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> okay. I lost this one. Um... What do I need? I could use... I mean, make a stand would be nice. Uh, but he was using fling, so not really. Um, immolating glare. I need it. I don't even care what I have to pull. Probably this. They aren't even big enough. Uh, those are. This is bullshit. Um, uh, okay, I'm at 61. Authority I can't drop. I'll just drop uh, planes. Your I won't regret that. Because I'm actually getting rid of the... Um, the Gacellas. So, uh, this isn't bad. I mean, it'll cause him some, some, some damage. Hey, authority of the console is awesome. I'm going to go catch the shit out of that Machop after this, though. I'll tell you that. I need 85 more candy to get him a champ, which I've given up. I'm just going to catch one off a raid, but obviously not for about eight days because nobody would ever waste a raid pass on that. <laughs> Um, do I need three when I need three? Not really. So I'll drop a little planes and see how it goes. Here we go. I am definitely feeling this first turn advantage, though. I mean, that's a lot of two-cost shit right there. Oh, another Blighted. Fuck. Alright. Well, I mean, dropping a Sandstone would be cool on Lone, but he won't flip. Um, I could just do Blessed and just flip him. I mean, that's that's such a bad use. Like, so fucking bad. Oh, uh, what the fuck? He's using it to kill him instead of eliminate a card. I would have peeked at my hand. Um, okay, that sucks, but... Oh, now I have no more fucking creatures. God, these draws are terrible today. Holy shit, all right. Hopefully he brings out a reality smasher, but I, that might be a long shot. You know what? You seem bad. Clearly you haven't been watching my win percentage. I haven't actually lost yet, have I? I've lost a round, but I haven't lost a uh, a match. Or the other way around. Well, here comes one, though. <laughs> okay, what you gonna get rid of? Let's see. It, it, doesn't it have to cost... No, not three or... What, is, what did he get rid of? What did he get rid of? The fuck? He didn't get rid of anything. Was there a qualifier on it that it has to... Well, we had land, land, land. Okay, I don't know what just happened there. You got me. Okay, here we go. Um, I don't have anything better to do, so let's just drop him out. Um, uh, I guess Shafat might as well. See, these two are just going to wreck him. Once he finally gets his shit together, and he's only got four cards in hand, and he's low on lands, um, it's just going to be who can get a creature out first, which, even if it's him, I'm going to blow up the first two. So, yeah, I pretty much got this. My name is Desolator Magic on X page, duh. It's also, like, right there, and, like, right here, and, like, right everywhere. Oh, Wasteland. Oh, he's going to fucking kill it, isn't he? God, I'm sick of this deck already. It's so annoying. Oh, no, I don't have anything in exile. Haha, <laughs> douche. Um, the problem is he's not going to swing at me because I have first strike. But I'm going to do this fun little trick. Oh, shit, I should drop both on him. <laughs> I don't need to, but fuck it. I don't need one this turn. All right, there we go. <laughs> so now he's got plus one, plus one, and double vigilance. That's fun. Yeah, what you gonna do about it? F9, that shit. Oh, it is creature only. I tried to read it real quick before it disappeared, but I skimmed. I cannot do the reading. Why would he... D whatever. <laughs> RTFC. Either he didn't read the card, or he has completely given up. Or... I don't know. Let's see, I could get rid of a Blighted, but it would only be too... 
life. I think I'll hold on to that. It's going to be a while before I kill him if these draws keep up, though, because this is bad. I mean, I could have gotten rid of a Shafet, but that's more of a late game card anyway. Oh, Flame Tendrils! Um, this would not save it, would it? Fuck. What else does this do? Untap. Well, then what the fuck is the point of that? All right, I guess I lost him, so now this is going to be an absolute top decathon, which, uh, never mind those. Those are fun. Uh, Gisela. Oh, no, I took her out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe not. All right, we got two always watching, though. I'm feeling good about those odds. Just kidding, I'm not. Uh, but if he brings out a reality smasher, I'm going to bring out something worse. And honestly, it's going to die immediately. Uh, this is interesting. This is really interesting. Yeah, it's, well, you probably don't see me because it's not my lobby. Oh, shit. He's going to get rid of one of these. But then the other one's going to kill him. Does it does it say when he leaves the... Yeah, when he leaves the battlefield. Okay, so now I don't give a shit. <laughs> this is going to be funny because it's like two kill spells. So whatever one it isn't is the one that he's going to get hit by. <laughs> this is such a fun game, even though I really don't like his deck. <laughs> he needs more life gain. That's what he needs. He needs an aerial responder in that deck. But that would probably reduce the number of uh, control spells, so... All right. Oh, ain't that a bitch. All right, so give me my control spell back, you dick. And, uh, yeah, give, give me my shit. Give me, give me, give me, give me a card. Oh, wait, that's right. You don't get your card back. You get a different card back. That's actually funnier, though. Um, we'll just click, click. Damn it. <laughs> no. <laughs> it won't, what the fuck? It won't tap. There we go. Had a little bit of a server fart there. That is just encouragement in card form right there. It's a 6-4, and I'm going to swing at, like, 8 or 9. Ouch. <laughs> Two swings and he's dead. But he does have a clue, though. So, and he's got four cards in hand. If he has one more kill spell, I'm going to be pissed, but he's running stupid shit like Grasp and Flaying and... Yeah, I would have taken deck. He could have just not swung. I didn't even think of that. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? Oh, the... Oh, fuck you! God damn it. <sighs> that is just annoying. Alright, oh, that's... Okay. Top Decathon, I called it. What is best friend play? I've never heard of that. Oh, like, you need more cards, you dirty Canadian. Try and get those cards across the border. We'll stop them. All right, here we go. Should I just piss him off? I'm just going to piss him off. <laughs> I gained two life. <laughs> I mean, I had no cards in hand. I mean, come on. <laughs> I don't think he cares that he can't untap. <laughs> well, this stream is like 15 seconds. Oh, what the fuck? Are you kidding me right now? I'm giving you guys advance warning in the chat. That was the most suck out hand. I mean, the thing is, though, this, this deck is like 50% creatures. I'm not concerned. Well, okay, I should be with my luck. <laughs> Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there are, I think, 14 lands left in the 42 card deck. So one in three, I'm going to get kicked in the nuts. Um, why he's not hitting me with his shambling, I don't know. Dude, after this match, I am going to go about 100 miles an hour down the damn road and catch a fucking machoke or machamp or my little dude. <laughs> it's the little one, the little pequeño one. Oh, fuck, now he gets one of my cards. Well, shit. I might lose this. I would laugh if it's always watching, though. That would actually be kind of funny. It would help out his shambling, which he should have been hitting me with this entire time. Yeah, I'm in a game. That's why he probably can't find me. And it's not my game lobby, so... Yeah. 
Oh, today, asshole. Oh my god. What, does he got to read my cards? I'm playing with, like, BFZ cards. Like, come on. It's not a mystery what these do. Oh, for fuck's sake, it froze. <sighs> Let me try F10-ing. That's how you unfreeze it. You request a rollback and then cancel it. It's like X Mage doesn't want me to check uh, to catch this damn much. What the hell is it? <laughs> it's the Manat choke and not Machamp. Machop? Yeah. Choppy. Choppy dude. I'm just gonna catch the damn Teddy Ursa right here. There we go. Uh, Something happened, I think, maybe. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm catching Pokemon. When you're playing X Mage, you basically need something else to do. I mean, <laughs> if you gotta do a monitors. Go for it. <laughs> there we go. There it is. There it is. Okay. Well, he just popped up on the radar, so theoretically I have 30 minutes, but I'm not sure about that. He's at a restaurant right down the street. <laughs> there we go. Oh, now the chat server's fucking freezing! I knew this would happen. I knew it! Every time we get more than, like, five spectators, they freeze the fucking game. Why the hell can't they be as smart as the other 93 people that are watching this on YouTube? Oh my god. Every time I get on X-Mage, some stupid bullshit happens and I get pissed off. Every time. Every single time. That's why I stopped playing on it. But I cannot stand cockatrees. <laughs> but I did just get an excellent throw on that Venonat, so there's that. Oh, I was waiting for... Didn't I press F fucking 9? Alright, good luck swinging at me. Here we go. Let's have some fun. I can play removals, too. I don't know, I've never been there. It's expensive as shit. Bring the shambling, I dare ya. Oh, that says for as long as that card remains exiled, but I'm pretty sure Gonti has to still be in play, though. Because, like, he's the one saying it. Oh, fucking hell. So that's what it was, wasn't it? <laughs> Unless he's running one, I doubt it. Oh, now I gotta emulate this one. Ooh, wow. He got lucky. Yeah, I'll fuck you too. There you go. Oh! Fuck, I forgot about that! God damn it! Fuck, I cannot fucking believe that I forgot that you can't hit it. Damn it! I kept thinking it was blessed. <sighs> This'll be fun. I cannot stand Reality Smasher. Whoever decided to approve that card, <coughs> Aaron fucking Forsyth, <coughs> excuse me, should be fired. Oh, fuck you. He's gonna... God damn it. There, pick that one, asshole. I just lost anyway, but I might as well, like, play. I cannot fucking stand Reality Smasher. That card never, never should have been printed. It's too fucking powerful. And now whatever I drop into block is dead, so I already lost. Unless I, I don't know, pull a board wipe that I don't have. God, he lucked out so fucking hard on this. And I can't target him now either. <sighs> Maybe I'll get a card anyway. Yep, I will. <laughs> Oh, good. That helps a whole bunch. I can boost his fucking piece of shit. Which somehow that targeted correctly. Whatever. I already lost. Alright, so I gotta go check, uh, catch the Machop. Maybe I'll start a second stream after this. But uh, 
I will perhaps be back. Otherwise, watch for a different video. Thanks for watching, everybody. And congratulations to the person who finally beat me after about four rounds. And I will see you guys next time.